everybody. I just wanted to let you know where we are. We're actually on uh, Malax Lake. It's in uh, uh, north central Minnesota. It's a huge freshwater lake. Uh, this is a historical marker that we stopped at on the lake, right on the highway, of course, and I apologize, but it is just beautiful up here. Um, I have to share this with you because they always said it was Paul Bunyan and, and Babe that made the 10,000 lakes of Minnesota. And I'll let you read, pause and read that sign if you care, but it was, I thought it was kind of cute. Looks like it's a little, uh, so this is close for the season right now, but little building must be like a um, information center, little information center here. And I thought this was interesting. It's going to make me want to go read the story now. I've been reading a lot of um, places that we go are talking about these big storms all around that year. Anyway, this is looking out Lake Malax from this point. Um, the colors are just gorgeous up here. I'm hoping it shows up how pretty the colors are, the reds and the oranges and the yellows. And I can't believe it, but I can see my breath occasionally. I didn't think it was that cold. And I'll zoom back out walk over here this is a huge lake and to tell you the truth the last time i was up here was between 40 and 45 years ago and i i guess i should quit saying that that i'm kind of sad because now it's just uh, all private property along the lake very little public access and i'm a midwesterner we don't have seagulls where I'm from, so I'm always intrigued by seagulls. Of course, people make fun of me for that. I've heard there. Look at that dock. Just lined with seagulls. Anyway, we, we're driving around the lake right now, and then we're heading up to heading north. I think we're going to go about another hour where my brother's cabin is. I'm not sure where we'll go from there. I know we're going to Lake Superior at some point. And then we'll come home down through Wisconsin, Illinois, go to our sons in Missouri. Okay, this is why they don't like seagulls. I get it. We have birds like that back home too that leave their calling card everywhere they go. There's a boat way out there on the lake. I think it's got just about every fish there is. Yay! Got me a seagull flying in. I'm going to walk around. It's got this real nice walkway all around here. Years ago when I was in Seattle, people just laughed at me, but when the seagulls would eat the french fries right out of my hands, I had more fun. And then it's just a nice little park that goes around on the edge of the town. It's been a beautiful drive going this way, seeing all the fall colors. That's one thing I miss about Minnesota is the distinct four seasons. I can't get the old farmer up here in the winter. He doesn't understand it's really not as bad as as the weathermen make it sound. So anyway, I'll pan back around towards the lake. Let you know. I think I've got three or four other boring videos to upload. I may get them uploaded. Haven't been anywhere where I can really spend time doing that. So talk to y'all later.